you don't remember me, I am Christine Davis, the Director of Humane Education here at the SPCA Serve in Erie County. So today, that's my little bird friend in the back. Um, today I'm going to be showing you how to make simple, easy, funny enrichment items today. So as you can see right now, we have several bunnies um, that will be available for adoption very soon. Um, we get bunnies in at the shelter quite often. We have over 20 bunnies in foster care, including the three I am, I am currently taking care of, which you'll meet later. So the one thing about bunnies is they're fun, um, they make great pets, but they're commitment. So they like to chew things. Um, and they need a lot of things to help wear down their teeth because bunnies' teeth grow continuously over their life. Um, so they're always looking for things to chew, which can sometimes turn into destructive behavior. So what I do is I look for a lot of things and a lot of toys for my bunnies or my foster bunnies um, at home so they're not chewing up uh, their bedding, so they're not chewing up um, the rugs and things like that. Um, the other thing to remember about bunnies is that they have to have a lot of hay in their diet. Hay helps their digestive system move, so the more items you can get with hay, the more likely they are going to be um, to chew on those things. So thank everyone, again, who donated um, supplies for us to be able to take care of the bunnies we currently have in Foster, and including the bunnies that we hear waiting for adoption. So without further ado, I'm going to go and I'm going to show you um, what we're going to be making today. So one of the things you're going to need is toilet paper tubes. And if you're like me, you probably got a lot of these laying around right now. So you can either recycle them or you can turn them into cool pet toys. In our case, bunny toys. You're also going to need some hay because bunny loves bunnies love hay. Some scissors. Cardboard egg carton. Uh, brown paper bags if you have any left over from your bag lunch. And you also want to get some rope. It could be Cecil rope, this is juke twine, or they make something called seagrass rope. All of these things are, are safe for your bunny to chew on. All right, so we're gonna get started. The first thing we're gonna do is called the firecracker. So I'm just gonna take a toilet paper tube and I'm just gonna cut slits right up the side. Keep going all the way around until you get to the to the your starting cut. And I'm gonna flip it over. I'm gonna go on the other side. All right. So now that you have that, I'm just gonna lay all these ends out. It's gonna make kind of like if you were to paint with this, it would make these cool fire firework type designs on your painting. you have it you have the firework so bunnies love to throw things and so this is something they can pick up and toss around their cage so a simple 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 craft right there the other thing you can do you can do something called the burrito what I like to do is I like to take their alfalfa hay which is a lot sweeter um, and it's more of a treat hay and I'll put it in one end and I'll kind of make the end into a burrito you can also put treats in there. My bunnies are too young for treats right now. I'm just introducing veggies to them. So I just stick to stuffing it with their sweet hay. Um, and then I'll stuff hay on the other end. And so they have to work to get the tasty hay out of the bottom. And while they're at it, they can eat this hay too. Um, I've been doing this for a couple weeks now. Um, I tend to find these in the water dish the bunnies pick them up and they toss them in order to get the burrito apart. So that's one thing that you can do. All right, so the next thing, um, you could take a cardboard egg crate. Um, you wanna get the lid on and cut it in half. And kind of make a puzzle for them. So you can stuff it with hay and then close it up, and then they have to work to get it out. I don't know how to cut the hay, so it's not sticking out as much. And 
so then they have to work to open it to get the hay. Again, if you're giving them alfalfa, you can probably stick this in the bottom. Um, if you're feeding any sort of treats like apples, because they should only get a few, you know, a few tablespoons of that a day, or carrots, they shouldn't be fed carrots every day, just because they're high in sugar. But you can give them as a treat. And what you can do is you can stick it in the bottom and then close it up, and now they have to work for their treat. All right, round paper bag. Yep. So with this. You can put a rattle in here. Again, if you have treats, you can put treats in here. But you can stuff the bag with hay. Stuff the bag with hay. Tie it up. And you can use your bunny safe rope. Tie it up. Now they have a little treat bag. If you really want to be fancy, you can kind of cut some eyes out. And a mouth, and now you have a smiley face treat bag. Hey. So I'm going to take these and I'm going to see how my bunny likes them.